Welcome back to Model 2.0. <laughs> Thanks for the likes and a shout out to all our new subscribers. I look forward to all your questions and will try to answer them all. Last time we wrapped up both wings, right and left, and got them stowed in assets true to P51D spec and ready for skinning. Every rivet, every hinge point, just where it ought to be. This time we're bringing it all together, the full tail assembly. Both horizontal stabilizers with elevators, plus the vertical fin and rudder, all joined up as one piece, unpainted, factory fresh, bare metal. This setup gives us the tail ready for painting, sitting clean against a transparent background so we can drop it straight into the next sequence. If you don't have open art, <laughs> there is an affiliate link in the comments. Or wherever you can get Google's Nano Banana. I use OpenArt because they have all the great engines under one hood for a single price. Here's the exact OpenArt setup I'm using. Model, OpenArt Nano Banana. Fully assembled P51D Mustang tail assembly, including both horizontal stabilizers with elevators, vertical fin, and rudder. All joined correctly in accurate alignment. Unpainted, bare aluminum finish with authentic P51D panel seams, rivet lines, and hinge detail. Photorealistic construction. Factory fresh appearance with light metal reflections and surface texture variation. Shown isolated on a transparent background. No stand, no floor. High resolution. Suitable for painting or compositing. Negative prompt. No fuselage, no wings, no people, no text, no background, no clutter, no paint, no shadows, no tools, no damage, no markings. I put the prompt in the comments if you want to cut and paste. Don't forget the negative prompt as well. Like anything else, this may take a few generations to it to get just right. That'll give you the finished tail section, true to scale, clean, and ready for paint. Now, if you wanna to begin to start the painting process, go ahead, but I suggest you wait till we have fully completed the construction of the entire aircraft. It'll give you better results. I also wanna give you the long range goal. After we have this bird all built and have it painted the way you want, we will then build battle scenes. Make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can stay up with the building and then the flying. Next week, I'll be going full frame. I'm going to need the room. See you next week when we will build the fuselage. <laughs> this is Rich Auerbach.